A Northampton County community is coming together tonight to remember two girls killed in a house fire early Friday morning. You can see hundreds gathered outside of the home for a prayer vigil. This as investigators are working to find out what sparked the flames. NBC 10's Brian Sheehan has the story from Hellertown. It's just a really sad thing for everybody in our little town. And they turned out by the hundreds Sunday to remember two sisters, 10-year-old Abigail and 15-year-old Brianna, who were killed when their Hellertown home caught fire early Friday morning. Their parents made it out alive. It's just it's such a loss. And I feel for the parents because it's like, you know, to lose one child, I can't imagine losing two. It's, it's got to be heart-wrenching. The tragedy hits close to home for neighbor Lisa Showmaker, whose two kids are around the same ages as Abigail and Brianna. My heart just goes out to the, the parents. I, I just I couldn't imagine losing both of my kids at the same time. Some placed flowers on the fence that separates the home's charred remains from the rest of the town. Others, like Karen Larish, wrote messages. Just wrote, God bless you both. We will miss you. Hellertown's mayor, David Heitzelman, describes Friday's fire as the town's worst tragedy in recent memory. It's likely why the vigil brought scores of its residents out of their homes. This is what small town communities are all about. When one hurts, they all hurt. He says that's why many have organized several fundraisers for the month of April. We need to continually hope and pray for them because it's, I'm not worried about right now. I'm worried about the years ahead. There's a lot of healing that has to go on. The mayor tells me he plans to meet with the family tomorrow to discuss arrangements. Anyone who would like to donate can do so through the Hellertown American Legion. In Northampton County, I'm Brian Sheehan, NBC 10 News.